Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome to my channel with a brand new video and today in this video we are going to do the comparison between the DirectX 11 and DirectX 12 into this new chapter 3 season 2. So guys, make sure to watch this whole video and also in this video we are going to see which is the best rendering mode available in this new chapter or this new season for our PC. So guys, let's start over this video. So guys, first of all, we are going to uh, simply do some easy benchmark while we straight uh, looking straight toward this guy's empty area or toward this ocean so guys you need to uh, check it out here the fps the cpu usage the memory and the gpu usage right now the using uh, by our pc into this new chapter and right now guys we are getting around 120 fps on the directx 11 i just real quick guys show you the settings here i am on the windows full screen and uh, all the settings onto the low the motion blur off, the rendering mode onto the DX11 and the allow multi type rendering is turned on. Also guys, I am recording with the OBS and you can also expect more like 10 to 20 FPS without recording. And with recording, I am getting guys less around 15 to 20 FPS into the Fortnite. So guys, right now like I am getting around 120 FPS with the recording and now it is the night time if you guys uh, look toward this condensed area so guys here we are getting around 100 fps and if we guys go straight toward this uh, section of the map where is this some trees so guys let's go down there and right now you can check it out here i'm getting around 140 fps and uh, it is not stable but guys still my game is smooth there is no any kind of throws and i'm getting uh, like around 170 fps also in some uh, points here is the chest animation and uh, let's open up the chest okay not bad now let's go toward this condensed area where is there's some trees so here we are and uh, right now like you can also check it out here the fps is still this table there is no any kind of storage in the game and also just right now this is my first game with the DirectX 11 and still I'm not getting any kind of status you can check it out here game is totally very smooth and if we go toward this section where is a lot of guys uh, these structures and right now I'm getting around uh, 100 FPS or more FPS and uh, let's go inside this area and uh, let's see how much FPS we will get here or, or if any kind of startup we will get so here we are and there is guys no any kind of starter into this condensed area even and my fps is way much stable on to the directives 11 instead of the performance mode i just got a little stutter when i enter inside this temple or this building and guys here you can also check it out here my fps is now uh, much better like 150 fps on the flying guys i think this is the best now i think that's it for over this direct 11 now let's go into the uh direct as well so just give me a moment therefore i can like switch the settings and now i just restart my game so guys here we are with the direct 12 into the fortnite chapter 3 season 2 and guys here there is a lot of guys problems in the DirectX 12 right now because when I just load up into my game I'm getting around like 1 FPS or around 10 FPS in my lobby but right now I think this is the first time I load up with the DirectX 12 into this new chapter so therefore I think this caused the problem but right now I'm in the game and you can check it out here the FPS difference between the DirectX 11 and the DirectX 12 we are on the same location and right now we are uh, getting around 20 or 30 more fps even with the recording and guys if we go without the recording i'm getting around 170 fps with the direct text 12 into this fortnite chapter 3 so guys let's go straight uh toward this condensed area like we go before and check it out the performance there or if we get any kind of starter because right now i'm not getting any kind of starter so here is this animal so we just kill him because he try to kill us so let's go into that point here is some condensed area but guys you can check it out here the fps is still the stable or getting guys it is improving with the time and right now we are getting around 160 fps 150 fps and it's a lot better i think in my opinion and also uh 
if I told you guys I'm feeling a lot better the response with the DirectX 12 instead of the DirectX 11 because I think the input delay is a lot better and if we go straight toward the section the FPS you can check it out here the GPU that you can also check it out isn't more than before because the high GPU usage mean the good performance of the game you will not get any kind of throttles because with the DirectX 11 we are getting around 50 to 60 percent of the GPU and around 70 percent of our CPU usage CPU usage is almost the same there's not a big difference but the difference is now in the GPU usage game is well optimized with the DirectX 12 because right now I'm getting more FPS with it so therefore guys I also suggest you to play your game with the DirectX 12 into this new chapter because it's a lot better we will also guys uh, do the comparison between the uh, performance mode and the DirectX 11 and the 12 but guys right now we are just doing the comparison between the DirectX 11 or the DirectX 12 and guys right now I will suggest you to play with the DirectX 12 because it's a lot better it is also depend on PC to PC because uh, it's uh, probably like uh, difference between the PCs uh, build so therefore it will be different in the FPS but guys on my PC I have the i7 3rd gen this is a low end CPU and uh, also I have the 1650 Super 4GB DDR6 and guys uh, I'm getting this kind of performance with the DirectX 12 and I'm also suggest you to play with the DirectX 12 just one game because first game is like uh, that will load up everything on your uh, PC all the map thing and then in the next game you will get guys some extra performance because this is my first game with the DirectX 12 but guys still I'm getting no any kind of struggle because the last time when we enter into this map or this area so guys we get a small stutter but but right now I'm not getting any kind of struggle right now there is guys uh, FPS is almost the same like before it is guys around 100 FPS let's go on the top and uh, right now we are getting 130 FPS with our this settings you can check it out here so guys uh, I hope so you love it and if you need guys any kind of the opinion about uh, your PC build so guys you can ask me in the comment section or also join our discord server link given in the descriptions down there so and guys I also hope so you love this video so guys please make sure to subscribe turn on the bell notification leave a like on this video and leave your opinion about this video in the comment section so till later the next video peace out